Racing Association, RSN on Twitch. We are coming to you live from Daytona Beach, Florida for the beginning of the ARCA season. Joined in the booth today, I am with Sky, uh, Terry, and MCV. Um, hello. Over the morning. Over the morning, Yes. Yes. Yeah. Um... I, how are you feeling about today? Yes, Terry, uh, you can join the booth. <laughs> Me personally, I feel like uh, they're, they're, these drivers are more active, which to me is a good sign that hopefully they'll be a bit more skilled. No offense to the drivers from last season, they just was a rocky start. Oh my gosh, the match land was but, like, Sorry. Whoops. Yes, the uh, race officials not 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 too kind in uh, in uh, telling us that they were going to be playing the national anthem, but yeah. Uh, yes. Anyways, um, as you were saying, if, if I may, uh, I feel like hopefully these drivers might be a little more uh, like for past seasons. You know, the start's always been rocky, but they're more active and such in the discord and everything so i'm hoping they're hoping the start to the season a little better i still think we're gonna see a lot of wrecks it's daytona we always do it's gonna be a bit of a wreck fest i'm just hoping it's a little more uh that goes a little smoother than last time around last time we had these little blocks and everything but you shouldn't have that problem this time i don't believe no yes uh the development has come a long way since then the league as a whole has come a long way since then on our side of things it should be fine it's it's all up to the drivers, and obviously, you know, it's Daytona, so what you can actually expect is, you know, it's hard to it's hard to uh, expect anything good from Daytona, but uh, you know, yeah. we'll see. Here, here's my thought. Okay, so a lot of this field consists of D5 drivers, and D5 we know uh, kind of sticks to short tracks. Mm -hmm. And this is obviously not a short track, so they don't really have the experience like some other people do uh, at this type of racetrack. So I think it'll be a bit of a learning process and a wreck fest at the same time. So hopefully it'll like clear up at the end of the race. But yeah, hopefully. Uh, you do make a good point with uh, a lot of them, uh, you know, sticking to short tracks and such. But some drivers said said they'd be good at. Uh, Bigger oval, Cypro, Bandit. Both of them have a. Uh, even though it's Daytona, both of them I watch them in practice. They uh, are actually working well with their uh, affiliated teammates, uh, manufacturer teammates. They're working with them pretty well, and uh, I mean, Cypro's on pole, so. Yeah, well. 
we'll just have to see what comes of it. Um, as the pace car takes off, we're going to be doing uh, one pace lap, two pace laps, if you include the one after the actual uh, pass through. This we have this brand new, uh, probably the eighth time the Spectate system has been redone. Thank you, Bloxer. It's beautiful. Um, yeah, I love it. I'm a big fan of the, uh, the blimp cam. It's very cool. Yes, we do have a, our blimp cam. Unfortunately, no hood cams or roof cam or rear cams today. Those haven't been installed on the Arca cars yet. Um, it's it's nice to see the uh, last year's car. I thought we I, I didn't think we'd see That's, it again in this yeah. league, but it's, uh, uh, nice to bring it back. You know? yeah. yeah, I know some people don't like it for Arca, but personally, I th I, I find it very cool. I like it a lot. I think it's cool. I think. Yeah, I mean, honestly. Okay. It, it's like nostalgic, yeah, and that too, right? There's like a thousand schemes you can, you can make. Twenty two people joining us on the stream right now. Oh, um, that's a nice that is a nice number. I don't know, sure it'll, <laughs> sure it will drop ride. rapidly. Now <laughs> you said something. <laughs> Uh, this so uh, who who do you uh, out of out of all the drivers making their debut today, um, who would you say you're most uh, looking forward to? I mean, the only people in the field I can really remember from from uh, D five is uh, Rock and Hyprosi and Korean. He's not here today, don't believe, but uh, I'm looking forward to his debut. How about uh, you guys? I have to agree. Um, there's not. Too many people uh, that you know I do remember as well, but there, there's two more I know. Uh, you probably don't know that I do know because I rate them in another league. Being, uh, I believe it's Poopy and Sup, or yeah, Sup NASCAR. Both of them. They're uh, <laughs> the best way to put their talent. But uh, be interesting to see how they. For me, it'd be interesting to see how they do in these cars because cars. Uh, we race them in another league. They. Half the time, you just for all setups. So. Mhm. Mm yeah. I'm interested to see how they how they do with this. Uh, I don't think they've ever actually ever driven a car like these ones. So. I'm interested to see how that goes. Yeah. Hopefully. Uh... <laughs> so you go ahead. Tara. I I have no idea like who any of these people are. Uh, obviously, I'm gonna be biased and root for one of my cars, but. Um. But yeah, I, I don't know. I, I don't know how good any of these any of these guys are. I don't know if like, I don't know. If, I don't. I don't know from. I don't know them from other leagues. I don't. I most of them I've never really seen drive before. So. Well, I hate to cut you off, Terry. The pace car yeah. is pulling off. <laughs> and here we come to the Geico restart zone. And for the first time in 2022, we have a green flag at Daytona for the Arca Sirius. Here we go. Here we go. Single file, very, very spread out uh, already, but that's not going to last long. My spectate system is not working. Oh no. Very spread out. Mm -hmm. We haven't got a wreck yet. Not for long, it'd be like. So, got... should be noted, this is the same package that Xfinity used at Talladega. So, uh, <laughs> we don't know how it's going to work at Daytona, but so far it's looking like it's going to be a. Uh, we got to move for the lead. 29 going up the inside. Who is that Ford? I think it's Ford. It is Ford. Ford. Yes, yeah. that is Ford going up the inside for the lead. Ironic Ford Mustang driving a Chevy Camaro. Oh, he's going to get switched back Maybe by, over by uh, a Hyprosi. Yeah. How are you pulling a crossover at Daytona without a hell of a Oh, he's in the wall. Ford's in the wall. Uh-oh. All right. The rest of the pack's going to catch up now. Here comes uh, Poopy up the inside in that odd-looking 28 car. I say odd because it's got like Lowe's, Madagascar, all sorts of stuff on it. There is oh, a car a slow. Oh. Number four. I didn't even slow. That's that's that stopped. That's dead. Oh, oh, so, uh, the ten just hit the wall. Yeah. Got. Two cars uh, a little further back trying to work together. The looks like the three and I think it was the twenty, but the three's gonna drop down a line. Yes, yeah, so and now we have 
two lines working well we did have two lines for a little bit now we have a single file line almost three wide Poopy thought about it and decided no thank you. Oh, but now he's looking underneath the apron. Oh! I'd assume that's a bit of flag. I'd assume, and Poopy's gonna lose lots of position. Oh, and he's gonna go through the pit limiter. That shakes things up a good bit. Yes, it does. Uh, so the arc is serious. No stages being used. So this is just gonna be a... Uh... Go get him. <laughs> Yeah, straight shot. No, with that, we could go green the entire time if there's any possibility. We could. Because right now, uh, this doesn't look too bad. I'm honestly, I'm just kind of surprised. Yeah. Yeah, I yeah. think, I think the this is working out for them, and of course we are getting some lag. But aside from that, it's not been too bad. You got two Ford, uh, two three Fords almost working on the outside. They're trying to form Fish. something out there, but uh, they're having some trouble. Three wide, three wide down oh. the front stretch. All Chevy's on the bottom now, that uh, 41 with the last four down there, he got shuffled out. And right now on the bottom, it's nothing but Chevy's. Oh, a little bit of contact. Good. So yeah, we have yeah. two lines going now. Oh, but they're struggling with oh. Chevy's. Oh, oh, no. Oh, okay, they, they picked it up. We're good. Two in the 20 make a little bit of contact. They're going to the three oh, wide again. The 41 yeah. is in the wall. They're going to be almost four wide if we don't get oh. it together here. Uh -oh. Gentlemen. Yep. Jeff Gordon on the apron. Oh my oh, goodness! Uh, Almost carried. They free merge safely. They do, and hey. they get the room they need, and this is looking okay. I mean, surprised. What happened there was Thomas. He got into the right or left rear quarter panel of Bandit a little bit. I think he's trying to push him, misjudged it, and uh, yeah. Oh, oh, that could uh -oh. be the first one, no? Oh, nice. close. Yeah, it, it is hard to hold your line with the with the lag spikes. Uh, you never know when it's gonna stop. There's your first verbal of the day, the 41 tight car. So is that a flag by now? DW? DW. Tight car. We got the, all the Chevys except for the 29 in line. So. I know, um. Actually, the Fords on the outside. I know they were. I talked to all the different powertrains earlier. Except for Toyota, really, because there was the VC. Oh! Oh, that was a. An interesting uh, block. The Fords yeah. made it very clear earlier that they have every intention of working together whenever possible. So, expect to see them together a lot, making moves and stuff, except when they get shuffled out. Of course. So here we come to the line again, working lap three by three. 6 of 56. And they I have to wonder, uh, yes, they are. 24 is dropping back. That's a smart move. Really, there's no, there's nothing to gain from running up up front this early in the race. Yeah, uh, it's it's not like that you're racing for a stage. And honestly, I, I do yeah. kind of miss that. But mm -hmm. it is also nice. Like it, you know, it increases the the you know, I guess racing. But at the same time, it also cautions are gonna. Oh yeah, for left sure. and right because of that. I I think the uh the big play for a lot of this race is hang it at the back for a while, as people kind of, as we kind of get closer to pit stops, kind of try working your way up a little further, maybe about mid pack that way you have good position in the pit stop so you won't lose the pack, and then drop to the back once you get green again and just keep doing that until the end of the race then go all hell for the front. Yes, I, I mean, didn't think about pit stops. I wonder how that's gonna play out. It'll I I green. wonder as well. Um, yeah, it, it just, so the two car leading the race, now that's Hi Hi Prosi. uh, he was a force to be reckoned with in D5, and he did say he was going to be good at these bigger tracks, of course, it's still hard to get a gauge on Driver's Hill, because it is Daytona, but so far he has, uh, lived up to his estimation. You say as he gets overtaken? Ooh, the three car, the big well, one, so Daytona, is. so. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Oh, back at the a little further back, I was gonna park the twenty up high three. That's a very aggressive move there. Yeah, he. I mean, wait, wait on the box. Mhm. Mm One on the apron. Twenty nine like and the forty eight, not giving each other much working room, but now they have straightened that up, and they're gonna push up to the bumpers of the Fords in front of them, hopefully. It's it looks to me like there. the uh, like the Chevys want to work together, but they're not the. 
the best guy at it, which I'm not surprised with Arca. A lot of these guys haven't really ever done this before, so. Yeah. It's a big, learn big, big learning curve to go to a from a bunch of short tracks to this in your first race in the Arca series, and then that's a massive change. Oh, oh, 48. Oh, oh hey, hey, Hopefully hey. That's those, uh, Indeed. yeah. Yeah. That was a good job from the 29 to wreck the field there. And, uh, merge front. Very smart move from him. Very, very smart. So as we, oh, 48, 48 oh, almost oh, wrecking oh. too, and they're almost wrecking behind as well. That was in synchronization. They both. Yeah. <laughs> 22 moved down on the 24 back there. I don't know how it's all about. You know, we never discussed like we do with uh, every season, Old Burner. What's, uh, what schemes y'all like? Oh, I mean, I personally like the 29. I mean, it's just I, nice I, throwback. I agree. Yeah, yeah, I, I kind of like, I'm kind of digging the the three car. Three? That's not bad. I like the, um, the 22. I love that color blue on that car. Yeah, that looks pretty cool. Got a lot of nice schemes here. We have a... A lot of very talented people here in the RC area that have exceeds of three couples blowing up. Jeff Gordon, Gordon Kevin Harvey, bumper to bumper back here. Yeah. Oh, God. <laughs> Where have oh, I man. seen this one before? Oh, he's making it. Oh. <laughs> Help from the 22, but if the run stalled out, the 22 almost kills the 20. Yeah, it's, yep. it, well, from what I've seen, you can, you can make the outside lane but work, but you need help. You need lots of it, too, and... Need organization. Yeah, it's it's hard to keep organized. Hard to do. Well, I don't know if y'all noticed, but the two and the forty-one, like they've been working they've together. Been, yeah, they're well. uh, they're they're just sticking with each other, and that's allowed them to hold down first and second pretty hard. The cars behind them, just look at them. They're so they're so well. Now they're also a bit disorganized, but they're so staggered, disorganized. And if they want to catch them, they need to. Well, oh yeah. my oh, goodness, forty-eight on it. That's uh -oh. a caution. I think oh, that's no. the first. Yeah, yeah that's the first, first question. That was, that was weird. It. How did he flip like that? I don't know. We got the race to the wall at that angle. Um, so there, now yeah. we'll have to see. Is the two going to push his oh, teammate no. to the lead or no? He wants to, to go for it. He, he, needs he wants to, side to go for it. He got a side draft, unable to. That's going to let the three, three close in a lot. Yeah, he might, he might go for the race back here. Yeah, I think the two's hey. made a bad decision here. Yeah. He might lose. Uh -huh. Oh, Jeez. maybe not. Oh, I'm trying to get oh, the run off the high side. Gonna go for it. I think so. Hopefully. No, it's gonna stall Who out. Who gets the run on the high oh, side? Oh, maybe not. Here oh. comes that guy to the line. Contact. Forty-one is gonna take that from him. Forty-one gonna get it. He tried it. He tried it. Yeah, it almost worked. Yeah, almost worked. Credit where credit is due. They need. Good for him. Oh, and uh, we Thanks, have boys. the Hit first the caution oh. of the uh, Arcus season. Boys. I'm gonna see if I can have a chat with High Prosy. Hey, hi, Procy. Hey, it's the guys in the booth. They got us. So, uh, first, wait, where are you at on track? Uh, if anyone wants to do this uh, interview, kind of have to do something real quick. I'm trying to find him in my. In my <laughs> oh, here he is, a two car on the back here. So, you and your teammate, uh, I'm assuming you guys are talking to each other. You've been you've been very organized, working very well together. Is is that your? Do you think you're going to be pushing the 41? Or are you guys going to be pushing each other most of this race? I think since we're Fords, we're going to be pushing each other. It like comes down to the lines, and I might pass him unless he like something happens at the front. But I'm most likely just going to keep pushing him because it's just it's a super speedway. So right now, yeah, that's a that's a very good idea. Good idea strategy a good way to go about this um well i don't want to distract you for too long the pits are open so i'll i'll let you go now but thanks for talking to us all right thank you very very respectful man you know i had a oh we got three car bandit gonna be taking it oh hey also, a fact i'd like to oh, oh no the 48 just oh, shut up yeah, I'm gonna say, I think you got, got a push big through. push from the 48. Jimmy Johnson making Jeff Gordon not happy, the man that owns his car. Canonically. The 24 is gonna be told to hold, and. That's fortunate. These are, well, these are drivers that uh, haven't driven these cars. I hope they remember the cycle their options. 
bandit already off of their road. He, uh, he topped out on fuel. I don't know if he meant to take tires or not. I can see. One, um, one thing I have noticed that will make, uh, people who like Toyota unhappy is not a single Toyota qualified for this race. Yeah, that's, um, that is really, really bad for uh, 23XI, um, Switching manufacturers this year supposed to be making the future of Joe Gibbs and TRD, and uh, if that is the future, it's not off to a good start. <laughs> so, uh, only I know, um, I think more of them were here, but only one of them was in VC. I went and had a chat with him earlier. He he sounded confident, but I mean, qualifying just I guess it fell apart for him unfortunate yeah yeah um so we're gonna be going green next time um okay. to make sure everyone's here all bunched up so it's uh fords one two three four and five so. yeah it looks like the chevys might have had a strategy there to come pit Oh, do we have one Toyota? Hold on, I think we might have one Toyota. I think the 10 car. Yes, we have one Toyota. That is, uh... Where is he? He's, he's at the back, oh, second one. Yeah. Can't quite see his username. <laughs> I believe it's Beastie. Uh, yeah, I think it is. That poor man, yeah. by himself. He just kind of got to. Yeah, nobody. Yeah, when you're in that situation, you just kind of got to find your your friends wherever you can. You got to wait yeah. for them to wreck. <laughs> or that. <laughs> got to be more aggressive when you're in that position, yeah, because no one's gonna work with you. I mean, you can like you can push someone, but I mean, who knows? The second they could clear, they yeah. may leave you out to dry. So yeah. Kinda gotta be more aggressive when you're in that position, which, uh, who knows, maybe he can accomplish a tall task of one of them. Okay, so Here coming to the line again, well, we're coming out of turn four. Pace car will peel off onto the pit road. And uh, we're going to have another chance at it here, coming to the Geico restart zone, and the green flag is being waved. Oh, oh the flag oh, went oh. terrible. Oh, oh my oh. god. What happened? I can't tell if the two jumped or the 41 just got a bad uh, Oh, no, and the 22's put him, he put him in the wall. <laughs> I, I do know that the uh, the 22 gave the two a push as the 41 slipped up the track. I don't know if the 41 meant to go and just forgot to press the button or what. Well, it doesn't matter what he meant to do now because he's, he's a... Unless his teammate hops out of line there and lets him come, but I don't think he's going to be coming. He, um... <laughs> he. He's, He's not gonna come. Uh, so. Okay. <laughs> Anyways, uh, still four and one, two, three, four, five. Holy right. cow! They're bumper to bumper through the field. The Fords are going, man. Yeah, they, it's been a long time since we've seen Fords work together like this. I think the last time we saw it was uh, was Team Penske. Penske. And, yeah. Season one. Penske and Ford performance. Yeah. Uh, my God! Oh, oh goodness! Oh. Cars in the way. Some damage. Oh, oh. It's uh, poopy and sup out there. Quite the name. Two people I was talking about earlier, actually. Back there with off of the twenty. I don't. Not sure who the twenty is. Might be Jace. No, Jason. I don't know who that is. In the twenty is. Still got lots of names to learn. I have no idea. Um, <laughs> Fords. These Fords are. Fords are. Uh, the they're they're working very well together. Oh um, yeah, the front three are. Uh, they're doing a fantastic job. Probably the best out of the whole field. Yeah, and very but, organized. But arguably, I mean, well, not even arguably, it is easier for them. That's why. Uh, oh, I mean, oh the no! Hit the pit road limit. Uh, Did he hit it? He might oh, have barely got it. But anyway, the reason it's so easy for them to stay up at the front and stay organized is because 
when you think about it, it's only three of them, you know, or everyone else behind us. I mean, that's like, what, eight people you got trying to work together? Yeah. And uh, there's so much going on. People are just not thinking. And here come the Chevys on the outside. Oh. That was a good move. Oh, when he oh. left him to dry. <laughs> Have you ever? That's a teammate. Oh, he's not happy. <laughs> that, that, uh, I believe that's Thomas. Leaving bandit out. He's leaving out my driver, man. Oh, he got he got served. Oh, uh -oh. come on There's now. No Can't, that's not gonna work, boys. Come on now. Did not do Simmer that. down. Simmer down. That just let a Ford get to the bumper and other Fords now. Yeah. Getting quite aggressive you here. gotta you gotta say uh, I Ford Ford versus Chevy. Go like the good old days. Oh, and now that's getting the front drivers on the club. There goes the forty one out of line. Slide, you want the lead back. Yeah. <laughs> I don't think it's going to happen. The 41. He did it. say he would push his teammates. Oh, they're going to be three wide off the oh, corner, and he put him in the wall Ford. again. Four That's wide down the back stretch. Put him in the wall. Again. And here comes Bandit, the man that got left out to dry at this point. Last oh, and lap. the four. Oh, oh, oh no. Oh, oh that was oh, really oh, weird. Oh, oh. That's going to cost he, them right there uh -oh, big time. Uh -oh. And that's why he's going to wreck wow. the field doing that. So what happened there was he got a big shove, and he thought about taking the run to the outside, but he remembered, no, this is a teammate, and then he braked. And oh, oh no. Yeah, 22, yeah, you're just going to have gotta to. Commit. you got to go back oh, down, go, go to commit. the back of the field, calm down, re regroup, and come make your way back up again. Yeah. Well, it looked like to me if he kind of got bumped a little weird, and it kind of, I know I've had experience where sometimes it makes the car kind of jolt up the track, you know? And uh, yeah. it, you have to there break a too hard there, driver. There was a gap, but it wasn't a very big gap either. As now, Hypro got two Chevys behind him, and then another Ford, and another Chevy, and then three Fords and a Toyota. I wonder what happened to the Ford car. You know, we saw him on the apron earlier, and uh, yeah. it's, just, it's just gone. I think you retired. Mm -hmm. As Bandit getting moved out of the way by his Chevy teammate once again. Hate to see it. Oh, I think he's trying to let him back in yeah. line. But you can't do that. You got a Ford behind you, driver. Yeah, he's Speaking not waiting. of Ford, so having a terrible day so far is <laughs> soup. Uh, sup. I, I don't think he's. His car has not graced the top five as of yet. Maybe he once got or a, twice. He got up, yeah, he got up there, I think, once and then just. Oh, hell, bro. Now that 41 is, uh, he... Oh, man, the, the in-and-out car is oh. in-and-out. Jeez. Yeah. <laughs> the 48 made the move for the lead with the help from the 20, and then the 24 was like, oh, I want to I wanna be a second. Yeah, now they can eat to figure this out yet, so that's very smart from the Fords on the outside here. Now it's going to be a 3v3, three three, three three, unless one of them decides they don't want to help each other. So now we have three Fords on the outside, three Chevys on the inside. I'm wondering why those two other Fords are back. In and out cars, Doran him. Hey, hey. Oh, and the 24 is trying to make a move on yeah. the. So you see, look, run on the look, it's just like, I think the Fords have a, a better, like, look at what the Fords are doing right now versus the Chevys. Yeah. They're, oh, they're, oh, they're oh, trying. Oh, and I think they're, they're trying. trying harder than the Chevys anyways. That's, that's for sure. Good. And because Ford, of that. Ford. Poor Easty, man. Just nowhere, no help, nowhere to go. I mean, the 24 and the 3 have been doing each other for God knows how many laps now. I, I don't know if Bandit's uh, eyes messed up and he thinks everyone's around him is a Ford or Toyota, but, man. Nah. So that 3 they car now being pushed to the lead by a Ford. Uh, let's see what he does with it. Ford's once again established on the outside. I don't think they're going to be going too far with that. The 24 drops to the back of that first line the fords are trying i'll give them credit they're like they I'm are surprised. Trying. and they are actually yeah. gaining but not enough a little bit i i didn't think i'd see uh let alone people working together but i didn't think i'd see a train forming on the outside in the arca series you know I Mark's, uh, expect hey that. look look at that the toyota's starting to make some ground hey here comes the 10 you there's see. a toyota yeah, guys, we were talking about right now, oh, there's man. the one. Oh, poor guy. The one Toyota, I know. Who will he? Who will he be? His savior. Nobody. <laughs> Imagine if he won the race. Wouldn't that be something? Here comes the 20 in and out car. Uh, kind of sold the 48 into helping him there, but he's gonna actually let off, and now the 48 is gonna be left out to dry. 
Oh, it's gonna turn him. Oh, wow. <laughs> He's not happy. So it should be said, oh. while oh. these oh. two are oh. killing each other, I don't think oh. they're very happy with each other, but there are two cars waiting to merge. It's the 4 of Rock and the 29 of Ford. Oh, yeah, What's what rock? happened? What do you mean? Wait, which rock? There's too many rocks now. There's rock pitter in the truck series. There's rock that ran D5, and now we got another rock. I think that's the same rock from D5, though, in this one. Yeah, the rock's only. Yeah. So. Well, there's a rock in the, the rock solids in the 22, so. The other one waiting to merge. Alright. Uh, Look at the Toyota. Yeah, making Toyota's are making his way. Hey, He's coming on through. He needs to kind of get on the racetrack, preferably. Yeah. I don't know. They're not going to let him on. He's getting bullied. Oh, yeah, my goodness. He really talk. is getting bullied. But he's not going to allow it to happen. He's like, you know what? The whole field up. No, all, uh -oh, oh, oh, my God. <laughs> this is not going to work. They're trying to wreck. I have been told that uh, Thomas in the 48, he's more of a road court guy, if you can tell by the Alfa Romeo car. Yeah, I was yeah. seeing that. <laughs> Terry isn't. Uh, Terry doesn't see. I don't think Terry's too impressed. It's not that bad though. To be fair, it's really not. Like it's people, most, it's just the number that will get me off if they make it like small and stuff. It's, it's the most creative Formula One scheme I've seen. The best. Like, I, yeah. I mean, it's, it's better. Oh than, no! But the Toyota. Oh, the Toyota, no. oh damn! The oh, but here he comes on the outside. <laughs> He's oh, oh, harder than the wall he goes the in and out. Does. Car. He waits for them to wreck each other. Oh, they're now four advantage. wide into turn three. Oh. Someone's going to have to give or there's going to be a wreck. The three card. Outside lane aren't able to keep up, so they'll just naturally fall back. And the three is actually going to find a great place in line. I don't know what the 48 doing, man. Like, Here comes the 20, but it's stalled 48's out. 48's been everywhere. He, he's, when he's on the, oh, and when we got moves on the apron, oh, God. That, oh, uh, oh. Very questionable there. 24 gets hard on the brakes. But, uh, anyways, yeah, the 48, when he's on the outside, he, his brain just goes, hold the A key. So he's just dooring people all throughout the way through the corner. Yes, he okay. is. Now we got Fords, one, two, three at the front. Uh, I broke one to make a move. They're going to be three wide at the front. Oh, my goodness. The 28 just absolutely <laughs> tore the driver's side door off of the 48. And Hypro's gonna be pushing Poopy. Poopy is not great at holding his line, though. 48 comes yeah. down, makes some contact with the 28. And 48 is, he's gotta be drunk. Yeah, I mean, like, he said it'll be good on road courses, but. Super Zuda is ain't a thing, I guess. But now he's on the bottom where he desperately wanted to be so bad. And uh, only two cars on the outside right now. That's oh, the, the 20 trying to make a move on Bandit back there. End up having to check up, get blocked by Bandit. Look who's making his way back up here. It's up. He's actually caught up to the draft now. And uh, now he got a mostly single file field. Didn't think I'd be seeing that. No, did not think so. Not at all. And the 4 and the 29 still sitting on a dirt road. I don't know. They are in the cars. I just I don't know what they're doing. <laughs> and they're 3 wide for last now. Put more than back out of it. <clears throat> and look who's at the front again. The, the 2 and the 41. Oh, they got brought up there through the tri-oval. Got to let the 41 close in. We are still broken up. Come on, get it together, boys. There we go. And I don't know what's... Those two cars on pit road, are are they They need to get going, because... Yeah. I don't know if they're holding them to the next caution, or, or what. I think they are. Maybe. They're gonna have... He's gonna have... Apparently, so I got a message from Race Control that the instruction for those two cars is to merge after the pit cycle, assuming we get to the pit cycle. And apparently they're being held because they both did not merge properly, and this is their penalty. Uh -huh. 
Which, I mean, it's fair. So. Looks like they... Going, I think. Oh, mind, they're go. not holding them for the Lopet cycle. Okay. Conflicting messages that. being conveyed there. Yep. I mean, they are almost at the pit cycle, so those two are going to have to do... I don't know what they're going to do, put them a lap down or something. Two laps down, I don't know, but... Speaking of pit uh, cycles, the lead the lead lap, the leader um, <laughs> right now, but these three Fords and the Chevy, they're, they're all running on about 100 milliliters of fuel. Uh, Greasy Bacon, uh, Bandit, he's been able to save some fuel, 700 milliliters. So these Fords, they have ran up front a lot of the time, and it looks like they're going to pay for it uh, yeah, here. here. Here comes the two, making a move on the 4141. It's going to be able to get back in line, though. Oh, but never mind. It's it's the oh, oh, no. Yep. The Fords look... you got some two. miscommunication there. Oh, my goodness. 28. That God. is terrible, terrible speeding. My <laughs> <by, by> God. <laughs> So the Fords come down to pit road, except for except for Bruce, and that's gonna hurt him because he's gonna have to either pit with the Chevys now. But no, the Chevys, the Chevys are, the Chevys and the Toyotas have saved fuel or something. So pit speed is about yeah, pit speed is 60 mile an hour, and uh, how fast will that 28 go in 100? Uh, about 100 maybe Oops, Mach like... nine. Guess we'll never know. <laughs> maybe. <laughs> He he! What I just realized when he by the time he got to a stall, he was on zero milliliters of gas. So I'm wondering if he was trying to get speed to coast. Yes. Um, so the Chevys they're going to be good on fuel, but they are going to need tires. Um, so we'll see when they're going to come. It looks like they're coming now. Maybe not. No. Oh, I think the Toyota. I, I don't know. So yeah, there you have it. Uh, the the 41. He's going to come down on his own, and he's going to have to have a good enough pit stop to hopefully pick up his Ford teammates, but I don't think he's going to be able to do it. Now, let, yet to pit out of the Fords, I think the only one left now is the 20. Yeah, so uh, this yeah. could go bad for the Fords. They decided to stay out that last caution, and now they're they're short on, uh, they were short on fuel. Oh, so now, contact in the back. The three and car. 20, Jeez. the 10, 3. They're, they're able to keep it straight, but whoa. Yeah, so here comes oh, here the... Uh, 41 off of pit road gonna see if he can pick up his teammates but they're gonna he might be able to i don't know that you have to go pretty slow on the apron to keep it down there oh yeah. he's okay. virgin he decided he doesn't need the apron oh my goodness and he's gonna wreck the fords because of it i think he's slow enough to try working with them i don't know if the, i don't know if the race race really that bad I don't know if the Wraith, Wraith official saw that. God, I'm having a stroke. I don't know what rule they're going with for the pit road exits today, but... Yeah, I think the I 41 have... did make an illegal merge. Um, I will re relay that Why? message. Why did I just hear a meteor land? Hypro is talking about the 41's illegal merge. I, I have forwards the message t to race control. Not sure what they're going to do with that. I don't know how they're... Oh my goodness, forget about race control. We got a car, the four car, the oh. four. Oh, look out! Oh, my no. goodness. It's like Michigan. Yeah. <laughs> Except this time it didn't end in fatalities. Like Michigan that one time. I don't know what that 24 is doing. Okay, so the, he did get a warning for. Uh, the, oh, oh, the 29. 29. Oh my god. Oh, not again! Oh, he just, he just hit the damn base car. Are you kidding me, man? This base car. Oh my god! First degree murder. Oh my gosh! How about that, huh? How about that, huh? We'll see. We'll see y'all in the RCRA court tonight. Yeah. Uh, so uh, to the lead of this race now. Okay, what is happening, dude? <laughs> <laughs> this car is just veering off the track back here. What is going on? Same thing the four did. So in the lead of this race right now, the 24 and the 48, that's Jace, who is incredibly slow <laughs> out of off the exit for some reason. And, uh, Mentally and speed-wise. Uh, anyways, <laughs> so for, for once now, these Chevys have some breathing room to work with each other. And that uh, that Madagascar car, he's at risk of being lapped here. It's no help. I know. I know. 
originally not too far ahead with the Fords, but they they worked all the way up to um, turn turn four. Now they uh, there are three of them working together: the twenty-two, the two, and the forty-one, all attempting to work together. And uh, you know, that, if they can stay organized enough, they may actually, or they probably will leapfrog the Chevys once if we stay green long enough for pit stops. Yeah. But however, I think it, when it comes time for the Chevys. I think the Chevys will be able to make it to the end when it comes to, or, yeah. Chevys ought to be make it, able to make it to the end when they come in the pit. The Fords, I think they're going to have to do another pit stop. Maybe. It's going to be close for them. Don't quote me on that. Maybe. I think what the Chevys are going to have to stop for, well, Jace, Jace has stopped. He, Jace has not stopped. Jace and, uh, the 24 and the 48 are on different strategies than the 3 and the, than the 3. So, uh, see how that splits them up. Yeah. I'm going to be honest. If I was a three, I would still come in with them because, uh, having drafting partners is everything on this track. As you can see, the 28 up there by himself about to get lapped. Oh, 48. 24. Ooh, get put him in the wall. He put him, him in the wall. wall. And for that, he's going to get shuffled out. And here comes the lap car. And he's going to be the 48 smart. Got or trying to take one of his laps back the hard way, or actually his lap back, trying to get back on the lap the hard way. Oh, there and we here go, comes the Chevys. Yep, and just, just like I thought, here comes Bandit. And the Toyota. <laughs> that is probably his best option. Out for it, speed. Oh. We got trouble. He almost made it this time. That's right. He think he had lag. It don't matter, though, you sped boy. And uh, got to pay the price. You can't find this. You don't. Stall. You can't do the crime, don't... <sighs> the time yeah. don't do the crime <laughs> <laughs> so let's see if he's gonna do his hold he better he better do it <laughs> non-negotiable oh wow the fords are on the front stretch yes here come the fords and they are uh, they are gonna, they're gonna auto leapfrog them it's because they're more organized oh no the three oh, maniac I thought you were going to have a fatality on track. Someone needs to talk to their driver after the race. Teach him the rules of NASCAR. Uh, he came... They're coming up on the, uh... Off a turn... Or off... Uh, they're coming up before the back stretch. That's right. I think Free's still in the draft. Yeah, he's <laughs> trying. He's trying to, anyways. Yeah. <laughs> so this field has been, uh... <sighs> incredibly spread up. Up, um... I think, we need a, I, we need honestly, a I don't even think there's going to be a caution at this rate. Well, maybe uh, maybe that group of three Fords, if they get, uh, like, careless enough, that they're really bumping together a bunch, but, I mean, that's much I can see. Unless Bandit maybe gets up there and uh, some habit goes on with the Chevy. And we're up there, there's another Ford. I think, unless there's that's a 20. car stuck on track or something. Or that 20 just that, came I don't know, there'll be a caution. Where that 20 just came off, he's going to have the, the, uh, um... safe merge warning is what he's going to have. Yep. <laughs> but he's going to have the draft of the three, and his draft might reach, uh, far enough back to the, So, uh, the, seeing as the officials are only giving warnings for the unsafe mergers, I'd almost say I would merge unsafely and take a warning just, just to keep them in the draft. I'm telling you the I'm truth. <laughs> Yeah, I mean... Oh, a comp oh, excuse yeah. me. We've had our first competition caution announced for the first time in a long time. Wow. Um, competition caution oh, lap 43. Wow. You know, this the announcement of the competition caution brings up something in my head, which is, uh, you know, I know, like, it's the... In this case, it's mainly to keep it entertaining. But, I mean... At that point, why not have stages, you know? Do we really still need uh, comp cautions? But I'm yeah, the Fords sure. did their job to get up front. Yeah, they they played the strategy right. They've been working together amazingly. That's the only, the only reason they jumped the Chevys is really because they've been working together. So, uh, yeah, I have to wonder, do we really still need comp cautions? I mean, either stages or no stages, in my, my opinion. Well, uh, that's, that's the sport, I mean... Whether you have the stages or not, the competition caution, they're, they're there, so. I guess it's also the price you pay for uh, shorter races. 
exactly. Yeah, the Fords. The Fords have done an amazing job, and one of them deserves to win the race, for sure. Agree. They have. Uh, they've really been the class of the field today, in my opinion. They've been the best of working together, strategy-wise. I mean, okay. oh, I. Oh, speaking uh, of. That's maybe I shouldn't speak too soon. I'll let the race end first. <laughs> By the way, yeah. I was right about the uh, the three, the Jeez, twenty, and the twenty-four. Kill each other. Here comes the three with the draft, and he's got the 20 in his draft, and then I, the 24, I believe, barely has the 20's draft, so that's bringing them all back in. Now, luckily for the 24th at the front. Oh! Oh, the 41's going on there. Huh! That's interesting. You think they might have to pit again? For the oh, he's race? actually got to go. The f well, ah! That's unfortunate, unfortunate man. That's sad. He was doing a great job. And I, uh, That's going to be a did not finish. Yep. Or someone that truly deserved a top five, in my opinion. But, but as 22 continues to lead, here comes Bandit. And he's just going to go right up the inside. Two's yeah, going to actually no, like, what? Uh, well, what's going on here? What's going on with the two? This might be a strategy. <laughs> oh, he's got 200 milliliters of fuel. Did he, he not? might be coming down we got a bit again. What happened with him? I don't think him? he took enough gas. I don't I, think he I, took I, gas. <laughs> what? <laughs> he's staying out. No, I he's... He's, he's, he's going to try to make it to the... Yeah, he may saving. as well make it to the comp caution at yeah. this point. That's what he. That's what he's doing. He's saving. I think he was going... Yeah. Oh, you're right. Maybe the smartest the D4 driver we got so far is Hypro. <laughs> that, that's smart, though. The draft does save you a good... Bit of fuel. Oh, and that radioactive video. He better drag it down. He better. He better. He better uh, let off on the bike. I don't know. He's. Yeah, you can save a lot at he, super he, speedways. He did his Daytona studying. Yeah, saving was actually what but got he, uh, those Toyotas a stage win in the Xfinity race. But here's the question: Did he say, did he start early enough? Because he he might still run out though. He still yeah, got. Yeah, from what we can see, he still got 200 milliliters left. When you see, uh, in my opinion, when I see it drop down to 100 or anything below 100, you you got to come in now. It's too late at that point. That's 25 milliliters a lap. Just well, honestly, he's committed to this now. There's no point in pitting. And even if he does pit, to be honest, it's, it, 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 I mean, he's not going to lose anything. There's a comp caution, so. But the pits will close if he, if he doesn't go in now, so. That's true. But now you got to ask. Track he's in a situation. <laughs> You don't get anything from this calm caution. No stage point or nothing. Personally, if I if it's that close for me, I would just go ahead and come down. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, it's not like track position really matters all that much. Yeah, I mean it's, it's Daytona when in the Cup race, I've worked I worked my way up from the back. I think we all did at some point or another. If I was him, I'd go ahead and come in, but it looks like he's gonna, yeah, he's gonna stick it out. He might be able to do it if he if he can do it. I'd be uh, in range. As uh, he's, he's just hit a hundred. Oh. As my uh, my telemetry is broken, so I can't see his uh. Yeah, he just hit a hundred. So. Uh... Yeah, he's, he's, he's he has not let off either. either. So, if it's 25 milliliters per He's lap, also running out of the draft. I don't know what's going on with this uh, two car here. I think it's piping in chat right now. He, told, he says he is not pushing. His fuel is bad. But, I, I mean... You can't go in now. No, the pits are closed. Yeah. I don't know. He, if he runs if out of fuel, he's done. If it's twenty-five milliliters per lap, that's what I've heard. Down I don't know why he is oh, not. No, I meant off. like I meant you'd have to save. You don't. You'd have to use twenty-five a lap, and that's just not possible. Uh, <sighs> he's got to make it just this last lap. If I was him, I'd be asking his team. If someone needs to push him. I'll just let yeah, the twenty-four. I some, I let twenty-four. I, mean, I just let team. off, man. Like. Anyways, he's going to make it anyways. We're coming to the cup. Gosh. But, I mean, that could have gone... Excuse me. That could have gone bad. 
run out. Under pace, though. I mean, usually only you, you only burn me. Burn not a lot at all. I mean, running out under pace is a lot better than running out under green, but yeah. I prefer not to run out at all. <clears throat> so let's see it, though. I'm gonna go for a spot here, too. Yep. Yeah, and he's also gonna get a spot, so... <laughs> I mean, it worked yeah, out in the, the end. Huh? Letting off so he can come push the two under under caution. The three maybe. tried going for the move. Uh, he he just hit zero there. on the telemetry. The what three car. The car. The three car went for the move at the start finish line, and the caution came out afterwards. Oh, so. I, think, I think it says he hit zero. Yeah, so he's not actually he at zero yet. He's just underneath the oh, hundred. Airborne. Oh my god. He's just very very low. For some reason, why are they still full throttle? Are they? I don't know. Can't tell, my tone's broken. Where's the pace car at? Where is the pace car? You're probably gonna pick him up on the front stretch here, they're probably yeah. around. Yeah, it's good, it's waiting there. Oh, they don't, did they do a race back for the comp? They did. Okay. Are they doing a race back? They, they, I'm afraid they did, yeah, they but did. they shouldn't the car have. should get his spots back, in theory. And its character looks a lot like Bloxer, if I'm gonna be honest. It, it does. It looks like a, uh, looks like Bloxer's brother or something. Yeah, those fours are gonna get their faces back now. Yep. You know, when when does the comp caution dictate it at the line? And then, you... oh, Joe. So high high pro sees high high is panicking. kick. <laughs> he's asking. He's asking Jace to push <laughs> him. Oh, he's out of gas. I think. Oh no. He's almost he out of gas. It's at zero for a while. He, he's got to be close. Without a doubt. His teammate says he's going to push him. Yeah. I, why is he not getting off the throttle, though? I don't know. I think he wants to try seeing if he can make it down pit. Oh, he's slow. He's very yeah, slow. Yeah, he's got to he's got it. go down pit road on his own. Oh, yeah. He, I mean, he, he threw, was in and have a certain amount of help, but I mean, like, everyone's got to go in there and pit back eventually. This is going to be interesting. And he, he should be taken. Just red, fl red flag it after the pit stop, stop. Nah, I'd, I'd take full fuel. So there's going to be a red flag after these pit stops. Oh. Uh, shut down? I think so. And he, he took one cannon too, just to, to... Just enough to make it to the end. And the 20 is going to be the first car off the pit road. And the... One of the two's got it. Yeah. So 24, 3, 28, 29. He's back up here. So Hyprosi made it to his box with five with five milliliters of fuel left. What a man! Like, wow. Is... So the red flag is out. I would not have the cojones to do that personally. So they're gonna be yeah, slowing down, hit. stopping. Yeah. What is him though? He's still got track position now because of it. Yeah. Yep. That'd be it'd be a lot a lot cooler if it was at a track where track position was really important. Yeah. <laughs> Over. That does kind of weaken it a little bit, but I mean, still very smart uh, plays by him. Oh look, you got oh. the Auto Club banner. Look at that. Huh. Welcome to sunny California. This is not sunny California. Yeah. Yeah. I don't... <laughs> this is sunny Florida. Sunny, but wrong state. We on the other side of the country, driver. Yeah. We'll see. Complete opposite of that. <sighs> well, I am going to actually. Uh, I would do some more stuff, but I'm going to send it to a quote-unquote commercial we don't have uh, an actual commercial 
because uh, you know. So instead, I will leave you with this nice uh, zoomed out picture of the Arca cars, and uh, we will be right back.
Hello, ladies and gentlemen. We are back after the red flag at our 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 right? Arca Daytona, the Lucas Oil 140. Um, so we are now on board with the, the pace car driven by Dames. Um, so we're gonna have basically ten to go when we restart the race. So all those Fords say they've done their hard work. They've had it taken away from them now. And everyone is going to get a chance to uh, go win a race. Well, even though it's Daytona, we got to do the classic. Uh, those are picks to win. Or, or I guess the credit bank wants the watch. Honestly, I, I think the Fords should. I, I'd like one of the Fords to win. I think it's been a while since we've had a Ford win. That's a lie. Uh, no, it actually hasn't been a while since we've had a Ford win. I think the last Ford's Ford's win at Super Speedways in uh, in the RSRA, except for like Xander in uh, and you Sky in D1, but um, the lower division it's usually been a Ford winning at Super Speedway, so I'd like to see a Ford win it. Yeah, Super I cool. mean uh, they've definitely been the best at working together. Maybe maybe something about the Ford organization. They're just uh, Really good about working together everywhere. Yeah, they're really good, and you know what? For for what it's been, this super speedway race has been pretty organized. Like, I am kind of excited. It's a it's a shame they have such a short season. I'm excited to see uh, if this or, is the future of the RCRA. Then I mean, it looks like a good future. Mm -hmm. Not to not to poo poo on the Cup Series, but I mean, uh, it, this has been a little a little bit better. Wait, wait, wait! Before you say that, well, we also a had different packages. Individuals. Correct. I get that for select individuals that may have made it. Worse. Different packages. We're racing for stages, and again, select individuals. Yeah, I know. I, I'm not hating on the Cup Series or anything. I'm just saying, Friendly compared fire. to the season, old, like, season. Yes, I know. I am. Oh, we got the four car stopped on the back stretch, and this is something. This is something someone said. The four. Oh goodness, we're coming to the greed flag. The four car what stopped happened? on the back stretch. I'm gonna go look, tell them real quick. Oh no. Four, four well, cars stopped on the back stretch. Four cars stop stopped on the back stretch. So we go green. The 20 oh quickly goodness. gets scuffed out of I'm line. Sorry. Here comes the two sorry. and the 22. We got bumper to bumper. Coming up the inside. 20 left out to dry. Now. What the? Hey, the four car. <laughs> okay, we. Oh, never mind. Here comes oh, the three no, to put three. Oh, no. there, it, I've really, told them maybe wow, a thousand times, and they've done nothing about it. Instead of... Yeah, uh oh, we're gonna have a big wreck here. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no! Oh, oh. this was kind of almost hit him. <laughs> we kept her going. I wish they didn't throw the caution. Uh -oh. How did it take him so long to spot? Well, that was quite the eventful restart. For many reasons. Here comes the two for the race back. Oh, yeah, I forgot about that. But the three is Wait. pushing the 22. Oh, it's gonna, gonna be close. close. And the. 22 is gone. 22 is gone. That's it. I mean, that's pretty ridiculous. They had, they, they should have had more than enough time to recover that car. I'm going to protest the RSCRA officials after this race. That was just ridiculous. I, I, I do not approve. I do not wish to be in a racing community with that kind of a failure. Anyways. Yeah. Don't know. Uh, don't know what's going uh, on with that guy's internet, but uh, it's it's horrific. A uh, four. Sir. Uh, sir. Yeah. Anyways. <clears throat> Rock solid leading the race. Oh, here we go. Re-rack them, stack them, whatever. Ten laps you down. Yeah. Yes, it is. Uh, two and the 22, once again, up front. Uh, down and the 41 have been the best at working together. So uh, I wouldn't be surprised if we could just, if we saw them just kind of sit out there for a while. Not sure who's driving the pace car, what they're doing, but the green flag is in the air. And it's a great start for those two. Yeah. yeah, not no no surprise there, but uh 
think that he is ready. Jesus Christ. I would like to apologize. We truly do. We are, we are a professional set of people here at the uh, Roblox Stock Car Racing Association. We, we carry on with your scheduled tele televising of the race event. Um, oh, my God. Here we go. Three-car breakaway. Oh yes, they're tandeming down the back, the turn to turn three. Bumper to bumper. They're going to pull away. Yeah, yeah, the backpack is definitely not going to catch him. Yeah, I saw that one coming. But they're not going to... They're not... Oh, what the... Tony doing? They're not going to catch... Oh! Oh, maybe they will. Yep. I'm back. Three car about turn the two car. 22 doesn't know if he wants to pick up his teammate or block. He's going to end up blocking the three. I think the two will slide in here. Yep. Man, they, they really got away from the field there. Uh, so they're saying right. that there's some material on the front fascia of the 22. <laughs> oh, man. All right, second is first. Bandage, what what if all the cars had front fa uh, material on the front fascia? Invert the ore. <laughs> Cody Ware's won the Daytona 5. <laughs> so looking outside of this, I don't know what he's... What, what that was for, but that uh, so I they mean, have become disorganized and that has allowed the field to catch back up now. Not as much as I thought. They, oh, wow, Jesus, I mean, some aggressive moves. Man, that was driving like a two, Cindy car. Two cars really trying to get back to the 22. I think he's trying to find a way around. The he he's doesn't want, <clears throat> he doesn't want this Chevy uh, winning this motorsporting activity. I sure do. So we have had two DNFs, uh, one from Bruce going AFK, and the number four car for Brock Robloxian. He has also pulled out of the race, citing lag. His, his not not lag, his internet. Ah, uh, uh, unfortunate. Meanwhile, here comes the uh, the main pack. They have now officially caught up. I mean, there's about a car length between them, and now there is no length between them. They are there, and that is gonna. I think that's going to heighten the intensity of, uh, of this race. Oh, for sure it is. and yeah, this... It's coming oh. to the wire now, and they're getting Whoa. antsy. Well, the oh, two go to the outside. What's... Three cars they, not they gotta, happy they about it. they got to compromise yeah. here. What's 22 going on? cars not happy with that, and that is a pass under the double yellow, so I don't blame them. Yeah. Everyone's getting squirrely oh, at the line. Got, and this is where it gets disorganized, and if that is the, rate, the, the move that screws Rocco over, he won't be happy about that. Yeah, yeah the three is being told to give back to position. Great the job by the 22 there, Rock. I mean, he he saw that group further back closing in quick, and he knew there was a gap, and he had to get there quick. He just nailed the brakes, didn't overdo it, just slot right back in line behind the two car. Yeah, so Great the job, eight man. car, or the three car, had to give up that place to the 22. Didn't really give the place up because he picked up his teammate on the outside, so now we're going to have two lines, or they're trying to have two lines, or they're three wide three for wide. third. And on the 48th on the outside again, Lord help us. I think your your friends are now just other cars on the track at this point. Yeah, this is when they become enemies. <coughs> oh. uh... And that's going to put the Chevys up against the one Ford. And oh, wow, oh. beating and banging in the back. <laughs> Look who's back up here now, the 29 car. He was out. Yeah, for, uh, he, uh... Just the middle part. Here comes the he, three to the inside. Yep, the two cars slid up the track here. Oh, oh no, oh. he can't do that, high bro. Bandit. Oh, there they go. Oh, there they go. Oh, there they go. Oh, there they go. Oh, no. That's a teammate. I don't know how they kept it going. Oh, my God. Jeez, Louise. Let's take it easy, gentlemen. Take it easy, gentlemen. 48 car. He's drunk. Okay, he needs to get out of there. You can't You can't merge like that. Yeah. So the 20, the 48 car is really, really slowing down the 20 now. And he's going to compromise. And now the 22 yeah. and the 2 car. He needs to understand he can't be pushing up against these guys from underneath the double yellow like that. And he's still doing it. The 20 and the 48, someone needs to just say, you know what, forget about it. It's not worth for, you yep. know, they're just, yeah. No! Oh, no! Oh, my gosh. Terrible. That's going to pull out the caution. And that's all because those two could oh not just, goodness. those two were just pissed off fighting each other. And that's what happened. Yeah, that was. That all started up by the 48 there. And the 48. The 20 had to drop back. And yeah. Started. The 20 and the 48 were not happy with each other, and someone else paid because of it. Yeah, that was uh, hard lick there. That's hard lick, hard lick for Dale. Here come the, the, the fours. Yeah, the Ford's two with the 22 on the outside oh. trying to work together. Jeez. They might be able to get it. 
Oh, the 22 is going to leave him. going to leave him. Wow. This is oh, important. They're going to make a three wide. wide. The two's going to have to run. They're going to wreck each other. Ooh, who's gonna get it? No one's gonna take it to the line. He's gonna, oh, he gets They're gonna be back. very even at the line. I don't know. Three, I three think it was the three. Go. Holy moly! Oh, was that the oh, was that the end of the man. race? I'm looking yeah. at the finish here. <laughs> I got a clip of that. Oh right. my god, that, that was. We need a clip of that finish, or not the finish, but the race yeah, back. We, oh we my god. That lap. My god. <laughs> that and because of that. We're going to have a NASCAR overtime. Green light checker. God help us. Well, that's uh, not what you want to hear in, in Orca. Because that yeah. usually means someone's going to get the chance. Uh, 48 thinks he has the position on the two. Uh, I don't know if he understands that the two was very clearly in front of him at the stripe. There we go. Well, how do we think this is going to go, boys? I'm hoping that the, the uh, 22 and the two can just kind of... Uh, I'm by him. Yeah, we have yeah. several requests for the 48 to be parked. And to be honest, I don't know what what is like is. Oh, oh, the, this base is car out of hand. Get that. Base car isn't happy ah, with the field. I was gonna, I was gonna whisper. <laughs> no, I can't write it out. I can't. I can't. So the paint, the the pits are open. <laughs> I'm gonna set. I'm gonna put this. <laughs> I'm gonna open that notebook. <laughs> <laughs> I'm starting the ladder. I'm starting the ladder. We don't have any takers for the pits, and I mean, why would we? We're going green this oh, time. Gonna hit the barrier. Oh, Maniac. Oh yeah, I, I don't know if y'all noticed, but when the 29 went up and over, like a few seconds prior, the 10 car turned yeah, left just... and hit, nailed the pit road wall. You, you killed him. <laughs> like. You're knocking on a fence. <laughs> I got a clip of that. That was, yeah, I mean, it was uh, like, like we said, there was just the 40 and the 20. They just kind of got out of hand and then hit the 29 and it was all. All right. Yeah, I just turned anyway. So here we go. This is it. We have done 54, 53 uh, laps of racing and uh, we're going to have two laps to decide it all. Uh, the first race of the Arca season, it's been a good one and it's a promising thing of th things to come. Apparently leading the race is Bandit in the three car as we come into turn three. Two laps to decide it all. Break. If the pace car driver can, like, I mean, Jesus, we might have to bring him back um, now, home. Now, typically, like, you know, uh, okay, you know, all right, sorry, we're getting, <laughs> yeah. to the restart, oh, yeah. So the pace car peels off. We have two laps to decide it all here at Daytona. The green flag is in the air. Bandit gets a horrible start, and the Fords are oh. pushing. They're moving Big. the line. Two to go. Oh, Daytona. straight away to the inside. 22 on the bottom. He's there. He is going yeah. up And he's claiming the 22 That's jump to start. I don't think he did, sir. He did Will not. Will the 48 come to help Oh, he's the three. He's going to get oh, aggressive really with those blocks. He needs to get in line, and he knows it. He's watching his race he's go away. He is watching his race go away, and it's oh, going to be 2v2. And yeah, if I'm... He needs Would to it be smart to back off, out and go behind the 48 at this point? I don't know. I, I think that the 48 needs to do is, is is maybe give his teammate a push, but he's not willing to, and that's... Yeah, I think he doesn't want to risk the position. He doesn't want to risk the position, so the 3 needs to make up his mind here. He cannot stay on the outside there and, and do something. See, look, that's what happens. He's, he's, he's being yeah, too pushy. I'm going to go, and it's too late now. Coming to 1 to go. The 2, the 22 out front, coming to 1 22 to go. 22 taking the white fire. flag. The white flag is out oh. at Daytona. Chevy's here he comes. Sponsored by Credit One Bank. White flag oh, in the air here at Daytona. We have one lap. Chevy's are three Four wide. Four turns to decide the race. Chevy's are three wide behind them. That's not going to help yeah. them. The Fords are going to have an it's easy not. time pulling away. I'm wondering, though. Oh, left. three. It's all gone wrong for the three. And he's wrecking oh, the field. You got to take it easy. What's this two car going to do when we cut down to the front straightaway? It all Will comes he... down to this, the two car. He is two. not pushing his, he's not making any friends. Yeah, he, but here, oh, look out, because here they come. No, up. they're organized. Get, they, look, look, at, look at, watch the 24 gonna, with the big run. Watch the 24 with the big run. It's going to come all the way down to third oh floor. Here we come, single file in from the turn. Up. They're lined yeah. up. The 24 is backing it up. The 24 is backing it up. He's trying to get the run. No, the two, now the two is backing it up. Who's going to do it? Someone needs to pull out. Someone needs to pull out bumper. fast. Bumper you're to bumper, bumper down the back stretch. Go to the someone's got to go and choice. someone's going to go now. Go. Nobody's going to go. It's too late. It's, it's too late. late. And the 22 rocks all. He wins at Daytona. 
Wow, what a season opener. Oh, and they're wrecking oh, behind. Gosh. Rock solid. That's, he that's payback. And the Fords, the Fords take home a 1-2. Oh. <laughs> totally. The Fords oh take home a 1-2. What a job. By, like, Hell of a I'm job by the 22. Fords, I gotta yeah. say. I'm, Hell of a job. I'm happy they got a 1-2. That was well-deserved in my personal opinion. That was pretty Great good. Great job. Hold it. <laughs> And, uh, what a job that is, they'd ought to be happy about that one. I am. I, I have to. <laughs> I have to commend. I have to commend the Arca drivers on their driving today. It was absolutely. Um, we've had. Two, we've gone to two super speedway races at Xfinity and Arca. They've both done an amazing job with the driving. So. I think a good and chunk of it's the, the new setup. You know that we have for the super speedway. Being yes, out there. we, me and Doc, have spent a lot of time trying to figure out a package that and, works, and I think and we, have we found appreciate one coming from me and speaking on behalf of the drivers that you know run these super speedways. We very much do appreciate. It. Thank you. Let's uh, let's pull up our race winner, Rock Saul. He looks like he's gonna celebrate with his teammate. Hey, Rock, how you doing? Great. I'd like to uh, congratulate you on the win. You know what? I think I think someone ought to bring up his teammate too. Are you going to celebrate this one with him? Yeah, yeah, that's what we're doing. Yeah, well, you know, I'd like to, to uh, just honestly, uh, you guys both raced a, a hell of a race. You worked together, all of you and your Ford manufacturing teammates. It was, it was honestly something special to watch. I mean, honestly, it. Uh, if you have anything you want to say, again, congratulations. I don't got anything. I just I want to say. Okay. It's a good race. Um, Hyprosi, is that? Yes, Hyprosi. Uh, talked to you earlier about your chances to win the race today, and you said you would push your teammate to the finish, and you did. You did that. You thought about. You said you'd think about it. Uh, are you happy with your result? Yeah, because our team got a one and two. That's all I'm happy about. A team player, you love to see it. Well, um, I mean, that uh, that is an amazing season opener in the books um again um just commend you two on that i don't know does anybody else in the booth have anything to say to them uh i mean i don't really have any questions just great job both of you some of the best teamwork i've ever seen personally yeah that was for a super speedway i did not expect to see that i mean i you, you like to see it uh, we'll just have to hope you don't have any front uh, material on your front fascias. And, oh, uh, yeah, I, I totally don't. <laughs> exactly. Uh, well, again, congratulations. Uh, DMS, uh, a team that has really had its name dragged through the mud uh, in the RSGRA, comes to Daytona and gets a one and two. We'll see how they can carry their momentum throughout the rest of the, uh, the season. First win for the team, I believe, in RCRA and overall. I think so. I think so. Maybe they no. I think they have one. I don't remember. But uh, Rock, if you could bring your car to the uh, victory lane, please. Well, first you gotta go through tech. Yeah, I will. <laughs> I will say though, um, I did not think I was gonna pass Bandit on that restart. He just, I knocked him loose. He got out of line, and I was able to keep it. Yes. Yeah. Well. Is this the is this the victory lane? Yeah, or? that is. Yeah. Okay. Um, so I'm going to be start doing some. I'm just going to do them on the pit road. Jace, um, if you are here. Yeah, I'm here. Um, you had a actually a, a good race. Um, I think you, you did run up front most of the time. I think uh, I think your biggest downfall was being a Chevy. I mean, it, it didn't look like you guys had it um, not nearly as organized as the Fords. Uh, how do you think your race went? Uh, I think it went pretty good. Uh. At the beginning of the race, I wasn't doing very too well, but uh, at the end, I was doing pretty well, and I'm happy with the third place. I wasn't really going for the win, but I'm happy with the third place. And uh, this race was very fun. I had a lot of I had a lot of fun racing it. Uh, yeah, that's pretty much all I gotta say. Awesome. Well, your team making its uh, debut in the Arca Series, and uh, good for good for you guys. You bring home a. At least a top three, um, yeah. In your debut, so that's always that's always a good thing. Um, let's yeah, see. Got you can say what you can go this guy. Did you? Were you I mean, saying something? I was just saying you got. Yeah. 
Uh, Thomas, <clears throat> are you here? Hello. Yes, I am. Hi. Uh, your I believe is is this your first? Um, first ever race. Yeah, first ever race. Um. You you finished fourth uh, again, like right behind your teammate. So, uh, how do you feel your race went? Uh, it went pretty well. I had some problems because I am new and like to the rules. I had to get used to really quickly. They, uh, my teammates, uh, explained to me about their races. Thank you, Jason. Stuff. Um, the race went pretty well, but uh, you know, I had I was I had a ten second penalty from like pit lane and stuff. And then, you know, I was in the back. I didn't think I was going to come back, but uh, I came back strong. Uh, even with the lag, I had huge lats, lag spikes, mm -hmm. uh, but I still managed to fight for the P4 and got the position. Yeah. So. Well, honestly, since, you know, you, I'm, you are new to oval racing, right? Uh, I raced in other leagues before, but this is like a major one I have done. Okay. Well, first of all, welcome. Um, hope you enjoy your stay. Um, congratulations on the P4 and... Um, or was it P4? No, P. Yeah, P4. Yeah, P4. And um, I hope your uh, knowledge grows, and I hope you uh, continue with your momentum throughout the season. Um, if anyone else in the booth has any questions or anything. No. Okay. Uh, Bandit. Um, I don't know yeah. if you, you, know, you are here. You do have a mic. Um, congratulations on the P5 finish. You round out the top five. Um racing for RCR um, again I mean I think the biggest downfall for you today was probably being a Chevy um, how do you feel you worked with your teammates I think we did good the entire race we uh, managed to clutch out uh, three four five I don't know what 29 finished uh, I just think we did good all right great okay. Uh, do you do you think you guys could have worked better together at any points in the race, or? Most definitely, the lag really didn't make things uh, very good when uh, when like the pack was all jumbled up. Having big lag spikes just meant like teamwork was a lot harder. Right. Of course. Yeah, the yeah. lag does the definitely lag. Uh, make it difficult to stay in line. Um, Poopy. Oh, wait, just over on? Okay. Yeah. I'm, sorry, that was a little <laughs> odd. Um, thank you. <laughs> Again, congratulations <laughs> on the on the, the P5. Uh, no, the P6. If you had, do you have anything? Any other comments you'd like to make? Uh, no. Okay. Um, I, I did have a question. You, oh, go ahead. Um, how do you feel you're going to do on, like, a... Other old like intermediates and uh, and such, and eventually the uh, the road course, Hawkins Glen, and Bandit. <laughs> like, okay. I think Bandit has okay. left the building. <laughs> oh, sorry, sorry. I thought you guys were interviewing someone else. Uh, it's, 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 do, do you need me to repeat the question? Or yeah, yeah, you? please. How do you feel you're gonna do on? Uh, on other over like intermediates and eventually road course because back in uh back in d5 you said you uh would felt you did you would do pretty good on intermediate you still uh still feel that way yeah i still feel that way uh with with enough practice intermediates can be solved i really i, I think the reason i didn't like d5 that much was because short tracks are not exactly my strong suit so yeah Uh, Terry, do you have any questions for him? Uh, no, I, I'm right. Okay. Um, Poopy, uh, Sky, if you'd like to take over from this point, if you wouldn't mind, I'm going to have to do something. All right. Uh, so, Poopy, let's see where you wind up. Do you have a mic, uh, mic Poopy? Oh, okay, we're doing it the chat way. Hold on, does it, did Alex, Alex, do you have the chat open? Um, yeah, yeah, I do. Right, we're doing it. We're doing it this way. So, you got. Let's see where you finished. Uh, seventh. Not too bad. Um, seemed to have a bit of an up and down uh day. Was it? Did you find it difficult for you uh, personally to work with people throughout the uh, throughout the race? Get with my partners in. 
Alright, well, fair enough. Um, man, I, re I really want to dry here. Terry, <laughs> you can jam I, I, me. I'm back, I'm back. I can, I can take over again. What? Um, man, I've never ran dry on questions. Wow, no, you're hurt. good. Um, well, Poopy, um, <laughs> nice name. Um, we're... <laughs> Uh, call me Oopy. Not Oopy. <laughs> okay. Oh, okay. Yeah, Oopy. Um, very good. Uh, showing for you. Uh, top ten. Not bad. Um, hopefully, we'll see you. Uh, at the next track, and uh, we're gonna move on now. Um, soap, soap here. here. Soap, soap. Is it? Is it another chat interview? No, um, soap isn't here. Okay, um, Ford. Is Ford here? Yeah. Hi. Um, not probably the you're making your debut for RCR, which is also another team making it. Um, um, Arca debut. I did see you up there a couple, a few times. Um, how do you think your race went today? I think my race was it was pretty fine. Um, I ran to the pace car. I flipped over. Um, I had an up and down race. Though once I flipped over, everything just went downhill. Um, it was unfortunate that I had a bad restart on overtime because I feel like I could have gotten up there, helped Bandit win. But it is what it is. I'll just come back stronger next week for Phoenix. Because super speedways are not usually my strong point. That's that's understandable. I I, I don't like them either, to be honest. I <laughs> so, don't one and I don't like them. Yeah. yeah. Uh, they're pretty terrible. <laughs> they're terrible places. But um, <laughs> I commend you on uh, sticking it out. Uh, Hopefully, you can have a better time at Phoenix, and uh, we'll see you there. Okay. Um, Terry, do you have any questions for him? <laughs> yeah, um, so after you flipped, I know that was a hard lick there. Um, you're, uh, you're good, though? <laughs> yeah, I'm pretty good. I'm pretty sure it gave me brain damage, but we'll just go with that. And okay. that's why I had that restart. <laughs> and you get definitely, it, while, uh, it definitely while... wasn't me losing talent, not that. No, well, I mean, you know, the yeah. twenty, the twenty and the forty-eight were going at it, and, and uh, wrong place, at the wrong time. You're just in the wrong place at the wrong time, and as a result, you have uh, your entire life will be altered. Um, rest up, recover well. Um, <laughs> and our final person that hadn't DNF'd, uh, we only had two DNFs today, uh, Easty, but I don't think they're here, so unless they are. I don't think they are. I'm in the VC, just not in game. Oh, you are okay. Um, you're the you were the only Toyota uh, on the track, so you already were just alone. I I feel I really do feel for you. Um, how how do you think your race uh, was? That aside, I think I developed a couple illnesses <laughs> due to the uh, lag I had to drive through, but. I mean, the entire time, I was just having lag spikes after lag spikes. Would any of those illnesses happen to be to the brain? Yes, all of them. <laughs> all of them. Uh -oh. We got two, guys. We got two. <laughs> <laughs> oh, uh, would you say that, uh, are you one of those uh, people where super speedway isn't really your strong suit? Are you looking forwards to the shorter tracks, the intermediates? Uh, well, I've done pretty good on super speedways, uh, racing in Roblox, but uh, I did pretty well in my tryouts at Pocono, and I'm looking forward to it, yeah. Okay, yeah, awesome. Well, thank you for coming today, and hopefully in future you can have some teammates with you. Um, yeah. Hopefully Toyota can pull it together. Sending one car to the season opener is not a good look. Um, yeah. Well, I'd like I'll to thank everybody for their time today uh first time in a while we've had a race on a wednesday um and again i'd like to congratulate rock on his uh win uh he's starting the season off strong 
and he he was a person to watch at the end of the the D5 season and maybe he's going to be the same here so uh, we'll see what happens and uh, I'd like to thank the officials the drivers for coming it was it was actually a good race for Super Speedway which I am I'm shocked um, I'm sure many of us are um, <laughs> so on that note I will send it away. Uh, this has been the RCRA on Twitch. Uh, we will see you this weekend for some more action. Thank you, everyone, for watching. Goodbye. Oh my god! Crashing! Oh!